Hello, welcome back to the channel. I haven't done a video in a while, and I haven't done one of these videos in a while. Today we're gonna do something a bit different. We haven't done this in a while, so it's gonna be fun. And it's been a lot, it's been requested a lot actually, so it's about time. Today we're gonna look at my studio. I'm basically just gonna do a studio tour. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna bring you with me here. So this is where I film most of my videos. This is where I do my uh, my regular videos where I talk to the camera, I do my TikTok, stuff like that. That's why I got the ring light, I got the two spotlights. Perfect setup actually for this kind of content. Over here we got a uh, Lego city that I'm building. It's gonna be huge. It's, all, it's for, both for the dead bricks and for exhibitions and just for myself. I've always wanted to build a Lego city. So we got some stuff going on here. Stupid shit. I'm building houses like these. It's gonna be a huge city. I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. Got some set that I've built. Uh, just mashing stuff in the corner. I love this way of storing Lego. Look at that. Clear tubes. Perfect. Couldn't find any more though, unfortunately. I just got some uh, soundproofing up. I got the to-do list. Uh, over here we got some uh, technical stuff like cameras, uh, lenses and stuff like that. Over here we got boxes. Boxes full of Lego. Because these are from when I won Lego Master Sweden. So they are basically just full of all the basically just full of all the lego that i won i'm going to show you some of it take a look at this these bags these boxes are just filled with bags and the bags are just filled with lego bricks insane amount of lego bricks these are just two by two bricks look i can dig my hand deep into this bag all kinds of bricks. These are just two by uh, one by two by five bricks. And this is just one box. Let's take a look. This is just one box and this box is full of leaves. <laughs> Check it out. In these boxes are just like everything you could imagine. Leaves, trees, more leaves. <laughs> These ones, these parts are so useful for building uh, foliage. I mean, it's amazing. I have had so much fun with all of this and I've been enjoying like having every part that I want, but I've, I feel a bit spoiled. The difficult thing with all of this Lego is to just build something that is uh, <laughs> like big enough because I, I, I feel like I have a responsibility to build something huge and something great with the, these parts because who does, who, who has these many parts? I mean like that's my responsibility now to to do that and build that but it also comes, it comes as a burden because now I feel pressure of building the best and the biggest thing I could ever do. Which I'm gonna do. This is the start. The city that I was talking about earlier. I'm gonna build a city that is like 2 meters by 7 meters wide. That's how big it's gonna be. And it, I'm gonna make a video on it. But this is the beginning. And this is... I don't know. This is sick, man. Let's, let's look at the rest of the studio. <laughs> this is basically my own little Lego store. I got some... CMF boxes, uh, CMF figures. I got this beautiful set that I haven't built yet. Some uh, stuff, other stuff, some uh, railway sets. This is where I keep all my figures and all my figure parts in this little cart over here. It's perfect because I can have it wherever I want and I can just store tiny, tiny parts in there. It's perfect for building when I'm over there, over here, wherever I am, it's perfect to build. Uh, I am not 100% satisfied with how this looks, but it's do it, it, it looks alright. So over here we got some uh, just basically storage. This whole room is my building room, so I got storage, I got parts and just projects all over. These 
this is my lego wall i got all my bricks here i got all my different uh, tiles and bricks and studs and all of that got some sets over there but mainly this is what i want to show you look at this i got all the parts organized by color by part by size everything it's amazing i love having this workflow it gives me the opportunity to work much faster and have just such a nice workflow i know where every single piece is it's wonderful yeah you, you get the, you get the idea you get the picture got some more over here and down here and over here here are just this is just a box full of windows uh, what else what else uh, we got the boxes here we got tiles plates over here ah, wonderful and just regular bricks under here this is a mighty extreme collection of just light bluish gray bricks wow follow me this is the the hallway it's kind of small i'm in, i'm in kind of a bunker but here in these two doors these two storage units these two lockers i've got all of the lego i won from lego monsters those boxes that i was showing you i got 37 of those 37 boxes so there's a lot more to it if you want me to do a video where i just go through everything and show you what i won i, I can do that leave a leave a comment and i'll 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 make sure to do that but if we keep walking here, we got some jackets, and this is my meeting room slash uh, dining room. This is where I eat my lunch, this is where I hang out when I build and take a break. I got this awesome refrigerator. I just love it. This is the typical store refrigerator. Uh, uh, everything essential to live and eat down here. This is another uh, office space for when I want to like work on some projects or whatever. I'm gonna plug it in it's gonna look amazing ah that's nice i travel a lot so these boxes are currently here because i've packed some lego and now i've just unpacked over here is usually my stacked display case with a lot of mocks but as of now i have uh, completely destroyed this kill bill mock and these ones are in uh, a different city because i'm going there this weekend this However, I love this. Let me show you this. I got this fixed and installed recently. Come on, come on. There we go. Bam. And come on. Bam. Yeah, nice. Look at that. I am very happy with that. I want to get more of those lights and just make it look amazing. I want more displays, more, more glass displays. This is my stop motion room. This is where I make all my animations. Well, my recent animations, the old ones I used to make at home. I got this uh, photo part here where I can photograph my mocks. And this is where the magic happens. I got this black backdrop, which is perfect for this kind of stuff. This is the set for the Mandalorian video that I've been working on recently. Uh, I'm gonna tear it apart because I'm done, which is... This is uh, spoilers for the dead bricks, so don't look at that. Got some stuff for other animations as well. This is, these are just some houses that I keep in the background when I do videos. Because actually, some of this is... Uh, <laughs> I, uh, I'm embarrassed to say it, but some of it is fake. Don't judge me. I was young, I needed some sets for the backgrounds, I didn't have a lot of money. <laughs> and behind this black uh, backdrop is a uh, green screen, which is perfect for keying out LEGO figures. It's a bit big though. A lot of people have been asking what I use for lights, and I'm actually gonna show you that now. I got this uh, little electrical thing, I don't know what it is, but it's perfect for this, it gets me it's uh, USB ports in it. Anyway, I got these lights at different stores. I don't know where I got the most recent, but 
basically you got this uh, stud with an LED light in and you plug it into the USB and bam perfect perfect for small like detail lights or interior lights then we also got stuff like this let me show you this this one is red I believe yeah a few more LED lights but also perfect for interior lighting look at that it does so much it is so small here we can just pick the one we want or we can just get a USB splitter and have as many as we want so that's why my animations have gotten a light update recently they've become much better and much more beautiful in my opinion perfect you got all the kinds of lights but also this is a thing i found recently look at this this seems very i don't know it looks like nothing but <laughs> this is basically a light stick which is cordless and just touch wow that's perfect for small interior lights. Look at this. This is how I get the, the light in the most recent uh, Mandalorian video that I'm making. It reflects on the floor beautifully and the Mandalorian's armor. Wow, that's perfect. Yeah, I think that is about it. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, everything, stuff like that. Follow me on TikTok because that's big now. I'm doing TikTok. Follow me. We just hit 50,000 subscribers. 50,000 followers? Followers on TikTok, yeah. Uh, it's amazing. I hate the platform, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. Then we have some other stuff. I got a John Wick video coming and... Yeah, the dead bricks, of course. You know, you know, yeah. The regular stuff. I will be more active this year. I have been so far as well, so gonna keep going and keep keep working on that streak doing more stuff doing more videos it's gonna be an amazing year so stick with me through this journey and we can endure yet another year all right see you in the next one